that I thought Rayon was cheating on me. Boy. Like, we used to walk past places and then all of a sudden, hey Ray, Ray, you can fix my phone, Ray. I swear I love her, know that I love her. Family. We're back with another video, guys. Hey, this is your first time watching another video, guys. I'm Rayon. And I'm Brittany. And, and welcome to our welcome YouTube, to YouTube channel, guys. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. subscribe. Make sure y'all follow us on TikTok and make sure y'all follow us on all of our social media, baby. Down here. Yes, sir. Alright, guys. So today we have a Remember when we used to do sofa time so sofa talk, much? Sofa like sofa talk, sofa talk so much. Like, okay, so this is gonna be sofa talk. This is gonna be sofa talk. This is okay. gonna be sofa talk. So basically, we're gonna I'm gonna be telling you guys about the time that I thought Rayon was cheating on me. Boy, I can't believe you. Cause that's crazy. Guys, Brittany thought that I was cheating on her. That don't even make sense. You don't even believe the words that's coming out. I of your really mouth. don't. When I say that's it now, crazy. it's like it's crazy. But she really did though. She really I did. Thought. I did. I kind of did. But it was kind of, it was kind of my own like, you know. Insecurity. Yeah. Cause you know, all girls. I feel like some most girls. I feel like we all have like, you know, like these. These little moments. Yeah, these Especially little moments. Especially when things are going the way how you. Yeah. How you so. Basically, let's get started, right? Yeah, yeah, ready? Yeah, ready? Right. Okay. So guys, as we said before, we met in college. Now, the college that Rayon was attending, I came to like two years after you. Mm -hmm. like the two college years. we was attending, yeah. the college the I was attending. The, like, college we, the college we attended, I came in after Rayon. Now, ladies, y'all know when you come to a school that, you know, the guy already goes to, Soon as y'all two start talking, everybody is like girls looking at you, like something wrong with yeah, you. I everything. I find that to be weird. Son. It's, it like, is. it's like the minute you start talking to somebody, everybody want to tell the other, your, your your partner or whoever it is, your boyfriend, girlfriend, like, oh, he's this. He's but baby, we didn't even get there yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't even get there yet, baby. But anyway, so yes, that was the case. Remember, I came from the Bahamas, so I didn't know nobody. But and the funny thing about it is, school started August. August, September ish. Yeah, okay. I met Rayon in October. When I tell you it was like perfect timing, like perfect timing. People actually thought that I knew Rayon from back home. Yeah, that's crazy. Everybody's like, no, you know him from back home. I'm like, how? What they were saying? You you already knew him before you came yes, here. Yes, I knew stuff. him before I came here, so it's like that's why I came. I said, no, we did not know each other. That one day walking into Allison Love to get my computer fixed. Oh, that was, that's a life changer. Right? It was a life changer, that was it. So anyway, so we started dating. We never went, we never, the only time, the only people that knew that we were to dating were the people that were in, that I dormed with, were my two friends. One was from Antigua and the next one was from um, Nevis, right? We never went outside together. We never posted each other. Nobody never saw us together at all, right? Because on top of that, he was working in the lab on the other side. My classes were on the other side. So it was like we never saw each other. Tell one. Oh. Okay, yeah. So nobody knew about us, right? So when I first met Rayon, his technology business was like <laughs> booming. Boom. Yeah, Dude, I, was I don't busy. have my ring. I was busy. Where is it? <laughs> Go and get it. Cut, cut. Go and get it. Go. <laughs> Where's my ring? I'm take this ring off next time. I'm gonna have to sell it. I'm gonna have to sell it. All right. So, so, yeah, so basically, business was yeah, out. his technology business was like on another level. So when, so when I met him, it was like he was running all over the place. Yeah. So, I had, wait, hold on. I had a lot to do too because I had mm -hmm. classes. I had night classes. Mm -hmm. During the day, I was working for the school mm -hmm. on campus in the lab where we met. Mm -hmm. You know. So I was working there, and then after that, I still had my own business to do, mm -hmm. like fix student stuff and go places and fix other people's stuff. So I was like crazy busy. Crazy. He was like crazy busy. So the only time me and Rayon really saw each other because of his schedule and because of my school schedule was like in the nights. 
he would come over and he, me and him would chill out or sometimes I'll go over by him, which I didn't like because of the too dog. Too late. I used to stay over too, too late. Then I had to wake up early morning. It used to be a kid. <laughs> so anyway, so. I miss those days. I know, right? I miss those days. Those days was crazy. So anyway, so there would be times when like he would come back from class from the other campus and he would call me and he'd be like, oh, I can't come over tonight. I gotta go do something. And then at first he was like, oh, I gotta go fix the phone. Oh, I gotta go do this. Oh, I gotta do that. And then it started to be like repetitious. Like, and then sometimes when we would be inside that, inside inside my um, dorm room chilling, someone would call him, like a girl would call him or a guy would call him and be like, oh, I need you to come do this, blah, blah, blah. And then he'd have to get up and leave. And at first I was like, at first I was like, mm. He just get up and just leave just like that for no reason. For no reason I'm thinking this. I'm like, mm, he probably talking to one of them girls and he gotta go fix phone, blah, blah, blah. blah. Time that right? all this boy trying to do is run his business and make money. That's crazy. But I really did think, like, I was like, oh, so he must have got some girl, blah, 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 blah. When I tell you, it used to happen, like, so often because it was like, when I tell you, Rayon was busy as hell. And I think one time I told him, I said, are you, I said, I said, um, I said, you talking to these girls, that's why they be calling you any hour of the night. I mean, one time he looked at me and he was like, no, that's I'm not talking look. to nobody. I'm just trying to run my business. And the only time I could is when I'm done with classes and that's right. in the night. Exactly. He used to be telling me all the right. time, I'm so, not doing nothing. So in the nighttime, the later they call me, the better it is because yeah. I'm definitely not doing anything. And I didn't have no time. I didn't care what time you called me. Yeah. Once you call me. I'm dead. Yeah. She's he like, was it's too late. I'm like, what? Before I met you, you know what time I was out moving around? So I was like, should I? I'm, I'm, I'm. I was like, I really can't stop my time just because she's. Nah, so I was like, I have to keep everything the same. Yeah. So then maybe, I started. Maybe that's why she started wondering, like, okay, he's going out too late now. Yeah. One, two, three. So, like, I was wondering, three. guys, when I tell you all, my, my, my mind was going. And then there will be times when, um, like, out of all those times I remember like Rayon always remained like the same like the same way he never like been like oh well if that's how you feel then I don't think you could be with me no he just was like he kept on reassuring me he was like I'm not doing nothing I, all I'm doing is trying to fix the phone all I'm doing is trying to fix the laptop blah 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 and then I think like I started to relax a little bit and then you know what actually happened and I don't even think me and you both realized this you know what actually started to happen what actually started to happen was, was that when people wanted their phones fixed, you would you would come to my room and have them come to my room. Remember that? Or have them drop off the phone to my room. To be honest with you, no, I, I think I think that just started happening just like that though by itself. That's what because, I'm saying, like it just started happening. Right, because Britney building was like one of the one of the new building building that just went up and it was like a huge building too. So it's like tons of student uh, campus in the uh, I said campus. Like, <laughs> a whole bunch of students in the building, right? So when I'm over there, most of the times when people call me, it's, some, it's either somebody from the same building, maybe like on a different floor or whatever. So I would just tell them like, oh, come up here to this room, Brittany's room, and I'll just fix the phone right there most of the time. But that's what I'm saying. Like, we didn't even realize that. Like, it just started happening. And all the time, when we was doing it, from when we first started dating. And that started making you feel safer. Like, yo, this, this boy really do just be working. Yeah! Like, oh. in my head, I was like, okay, so he really do be. Like, okay, girls okay. would come to my room, drop off their yeah. phones, blah, blah, blah. But keep in mind now, people didn't know that we were together. Now. When people found, I think it was one day, he calls me when he finished with work. And he calls me and he was like, hey, can you walk? He was like, I want you to walk with me to the store real quick. And I said to myself, why the hell do you want me to walk with him to a store? Well, we went to Metro PCS. Yes. Yeah, and I was, I and I remember my phone. friend, my, my roommate, she was like, <laughs> she was like, girl, y'all gonna walk? So I was like, yeah. So she's like, he want people to see y'all together. He wants people to know that y'all are together. So I'm like, to be honest all right, you, cool. I we didn't start dating. I wasn't thinking about it like that. I think you were. No, I just wanted us to walk because no, because remember time, there was, was a time. Close. No, because remember there was times when guys used to follow me off of the elevator to my room to try and talk to me. Remember? You used to tell me. Yeah. Yeah. And so I feel like I low key feel like he was like, all right, cool. So it looked like I have to make a statement to let this be known. Like, all right, this girl is with me. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you feel me? Nah, so anyway, I don't, I don't think I was thinking like that. Though. I think but you were, babe. I think you were. I mean, you was, you was bad. <laughs> Come on, I think you. I, wanted, I think. Come on, I wanted to. I was. Like this. I was. I mean, you, you still is. You still are. You always is. I'm just saying though, like, come on, sexy ass girl. She just wanna be locked up in her room. Like, come outside, let's walk. You feel me? Let the people know <laughs> what it is. So anyway, guys. So when that happened, um. We walked to think after that day, 
all of a sudden everybody got it, something to say. Remember one time we was walking somewhere and some of his football friends were standing outside of a building and it was like, he went to go dump one of them up and it was like, yo bro, that's you. Then they started whispering, all these other things. And I remember I blew up on Rayon. Mm -hmm. Like when we was when we was walking away, I blew up on him. I was like, why are they asking you that? Because well, it was that nah, same nah, time. Nah. That was about to get a little spicy. It was that same time when we walked past those guys when they was like, that's you. The girl, some girl, some girl that I know was standing there as well too. And she, I was about to get on she that. She said, she's a high ray or something. Listen, know. when I tell you, girls are so mischievous. Like. We used to walk past places and then all of a sudden, hey Ray, Ray, you can fix my phone, Ray, Ray. <laughs> I used to look, I used to look at me from head to toe. Used to look at me from head to toe, dead in disgust. I don't know why. I didn't do nothing to these people, you know. You nothing. Sure? I didn't do nothing. You and then girls be pushing it a little bit. And then, when I started to have classes with these people, then they started to be all friend friendly to me. Yeah. Talking to me, oh, how's Ray? Oh, y'all so cute together. And then I remember, he had two friends, like two close friends. One was a girl, she was my RA at the time, and the next one was his close friend. And I remember, he had tell, he was telling me stuff about, about you, and it was like, he didn't sugarcoat nothing. He didn't sugarcoat nothing, he was like, yeah, this, that, and the next, but blah 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 i'm not gonna go into that blah 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 and then his and then his friend as a girl she was like right that's my boy y'all you could blah 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 but it's like i rem like rayon one thing i can say about me and rayon's relationship is like during the day like we literally will be talking about like how things used to be like when we first started dating when I tell y'all, I think we said this before. When I tell y'all, me and Rayon used to argue about the smallest things in the world. Look at me like a cast the blame. Brittany had like serious like trust issues. So you didn't know, have trust issues? I don't know issues? if it was like because of your past relationship. <laughs> so you didn't what? have trust issues? I mean, I just didn't trust girls in a whole. Yeah, he always just said, I don't trust girls, blah, 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 blah. That I just had insecurities or whatever. Oh, so a girl hurt me. I never said insecurities. Or, well, what I'm saying is, it's not like I was hurt in the past or anything like that. I was just never hurt. But you was, you just didn't trust me because you was like, guys are this and guys are that. Well, I kind of used to say the same. Exactly. And the funny thing about it is, and that, and I think that's why I kind of like relax a little bit because it's like no matter how much I was forcing, like going towards him, saying like, oh, I think you're doing this or whatever, he always remained like the same way. He never made me, like, he never made me be like, oh, well, if that's how you feel, then I don't think we're going to be together. Or if you feel in this way with me just trying to do my business, then I don't feel like we're going to be this way. Yeah, he right. never was like that at all. He always tried to, like, reassure me that nothing was going on. I'm not doing nothing. Blah, 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 blah. And when I, t I don't think people understand, like, when I say we used to argue, can you remember what our first argument was about? First argument we had, guys. I think oh, should we say that for another video? Brittany was no, we can say it right now. Brittany was telling me that she that she need me, and I was like, I want you. No, 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 hold on. So no, 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 no. I never said that I needed you. Or I never said that I wanted you. What it was, we was having a conversation, and I think it something had happened, and I think he was like, he was like, I want you, but I don't need you. I don't know why. Right. I so got that offended, means. So that means. But I never said that. So to that you means know. in your head you was like you need me, but you was just upset because I wasn't saying it back. Like I need you as well. And guys, we went on and on for that whole night arguing. I'm I like, think I told him and to leave. I was leave. like, what are you talking about? I was like, we just met. We just started talking. How do you want me to say I need you? I'm like, I want you. You feel me? I want you in my life, but I don't need you. I'm saying, but now I need. Now, my I, now ask him that question. Now ask him that question. Guys, when I tell you, I don't know what we was arguing. I don't know what it was. But when I say like, I feel like those arguments that we, those those small little arguments that we had, made us made yeah, us for made what us we are now. Because we went through all those craziness at the beginning, so it's like you know, nothing could break us up now. Yeah. Literally, and, and no cheating, no nothing. Is. That we we never had like no cheating or nothing like that. But it's like now. I'll tell Ray, I'll go carry you behind. Then he'll tell me, go carry your behind. Hello, man. <laughs> and that's it. And the one main time that she thought I was cheating on her, guys, I don't think you forgot about this, but I went to Brooklyn, right? And I probably fixed about, I want to say, this was, I think this was probably a record, maybe like, I don't know, a 
think it was, I know it was over five. I want to say maybe close yeah, to ten. Yeah, that, that night. Yeah, I, I think it was on a so hundred. So much phone. I think you was on a hundred. One night. I think I made over a thousand dollars in that day. Yeah, you was on a hundred that night. Yeah. One day. So I'm in Brooklyn. Mm -hmm. I'm in all different parts of Brooklyn. Hey, 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 hey. And, and that day, Brittany didn't come with me. So I told her, and then once I, once I got finished up in Brooklyn, Tell her I'm about to come. Oh, hold on, I gotta wait a little bit more. Somebody want me to do this in Brooklyn, so I had to wait. All right, I'm on my way now, right? Coming. Call her again. All right, I gotta make a stop in Mount Vernon. Remember when I had to make a stop over there? Next city, maybe like 15 minutes south from New Rochelle. Finally reached the New Rochelle now. Tell her that I'm coming to her. Somebody call me, and I'm not making this up. It's Somebody not, no, he's not making me. it up. Somebody call me, so I was like, ah, right, you know what? Let me go and fix this phone first before I actually go and see Britney and waste a whole bunch of time and then go and fix my phone. Because mm -hmm. you don't want to speak together. It's like, That's it's it. like nobody we, don't want to leave. Yeah, we don't want to leave for another so week like, together right, like this. So I was like, I need to and fix the phone. Coming to see her now, she got upset. She talked my whole, how could you do this to me? You didn't see me all day. I'm like, what do you mean? I'm working. He was like, still, you, you could have came by and stopped and just say hi. I gotta go. F no, <laughs> let me go do what I gotta do first. I don't wanna lose no focus. Let me go and do what I gotta do first. That's what I'm saying. Fix my phone and then we argued, we argued about that too. Like, we stood outside of the, um, I think that was my building. About the the building. Outside. We stood outside for a long time and we argued. It was heady though. But. For no reason. And that, when I look back at it now, it's just like, I was just. You tripping. For no reason. For no reason, because this man trying to run his business. And now, I'm the one. And then you know what came apart? When he started having his business and whatever. Oh, yeah. I put I, part of it. I mean, I'll start working. Why not? Get, getting packages for me, collecting money, because Alright guys, this camera tripping. Yeah, this camera is tripping, it just died. Yeah. But so, see what you finished with me. So yeah, so. Right, so Brittany used to collect money, packages, and all that stuff for me because I had classes, plus I was working and I was like off campus at time, so I put it to work. <laughs> you feel me? And then the best part about it all, guess what it was? I remember one day, he was, remember now, I used to see Ray on fixed phone all live long day. So one day I think I challenged him, I said, I, I, I bet you I can fix the phone. He was like, never. He said, I never teach you. I said, yeah, but I watch you. Because you know what's funny? Because when I used to fix the phones, Brittany was like, like, like she was just, I don't know if he was looking at the phones or he was looking at me. That's I don't know. Oh, you looking at me? Mm -hmm. Okay. Right? So she was looking at both, right? <laughs> <laughs> and then one day she was like, I bet you I could fix the phone. I was like, never. So I just gave her the, gave her the phone. She opened it. The hello. One, and he was two, confused. And he was like, like, yeah. was like, you been watching video? I, I said, no, surprised. I was watching you. I was surprised. And ever since then? Yeah, ever since then, yeah. I think after that we, we got even We even got closer. even closer. Yeah. Closer. Like right now, guys, if y'all looking for a couple that started out arguing for no apparent reason Come and like us. strong now, we that. Access I promise you, we are that. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it's I love you, though, baby. I love you too. I love okay. you to death. All right, guys, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. As you can tell, us ladies, sometimes we over exaggerate. Sometimes you just gotta. And let it go, you know. And just let What's it go. What's supposed to be will always, always be. be. That's it. And Rayon has remained the same way ever since that day. It's so crazy. Mm. He never showed me no funny vibes or nothing. I love you. I love it too. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, like comment, comment, share, share and, and subscribe. subscribe. And make sure y'all follow us on TikTok. And make sure y'all follow right. us on all of our social medias, right, baby? Yes, sir. And guys, if you're new here, welcome, welcome to the, the RV family, family, guys. Make sure you turn on that notification. Right. Make sure y'all put on your your notifications. Until next time, guys. Peace. Peace.